Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I will be doing a Fendi unboxing, so make sure that you keep watching. Before we do that, I'm going to discuss what I'm wearing. This is my new diesel t-shirt in pink, and then I have on Shein pants and just basic platform Converse. I'm drinking this awesome coffee with foam. And I'm gonna talk about the makeup that I'm wearing. I usually don't wear a lot of makeup, but I will discuss what I'm currently wearing. This is what I always wear on my face. I have a very, very basic makeup routine. And unless I'm doing a TV interview with my family or for something that, you know, is dance, fitness, pole related, I use just this under my eyes and anywhere that's like red, I have a basic lipstick. Kind of a pinkish tone because I do well with pink tones. And then I usually put this Dior lip glow or some sort of some sort of lippy product over the lipstick. And this is just your basic lip glow I've discussed before. And then I always wear this Great Lash Mascara. Not the waterproof kind because that tends to make my eyes hurt. And then for my hair, I also do like Paul Mitchell products and stuff like that. If you guys wanna hear that in a different video, make sure you comment below and let me know. And this is my bag of the day. It is the gorgeous Empreinte Neverfull Louis Vuitton. There's a bunch of crap in it. <laughs> if you wanna see a what's in my bag, also comment that below and I will show you what I put in my daily bag, which is this one. I have another Neverfull. I plan on doing a video comparing the two. This one is leather, the other one is canvas. Hold on, I'll get it real quick. So this is my canvas never full. And this is the Empreint leather. I plan on doing, like I said, a comparison, telling you which one I use more, why I use it more, and just all those things. So if you wanna see a video like that, make sure that you subscribe so that you know when that video is coming. I don't know why I can't get the lighting right. I have a backlight, I have a front light, there's daylight coming in. I don't know what my problem is. I got this in LA when we were visiting Santa Monica, some family going to Abby Lee's dance school for our girls. Cause they did classes there and I take classes there. And we went to Rodeo Drive and I picked this up. It's so exciting. I love Fendi sunglasses. I have another pair and they're in black. They match with everything. Obsessed. These I'm also obsessed with, but for different reasons. These are very Y2K. They come in this incredible, like fluffy package. Uh, sunglasses. <laughs> it feels like it feels like one of those padded uh, puffer jackets or puffer coats that I used to have. I since long since got rid of all of them. I know they're amazing, but I don't live in a cold climate, so there's really no reason for me to have a puffer coat. All right, let's open these up. I love that it has this on the side too. You can put this on your purse. It's so cool. All right. And this is what I got. Beautiful, I don't know what they're called. <laughs> to check. They say Fendi on the side right there. You can see it. And on the other side, and then they have little blue details right here, FF. And this is what they look like on. They're not everyone's cup of tea, but I personally really like the look. I think they look very interesting. Like I said, very Y2K. They go with a lot of different outfits and they fit very well up on top of my head. They're very stable. They don't feel like they're gonna fall off. A lot of times I have sunglasses and I put them on top of my head and they immediately fall off and that's never a good sign. So these are pretty incredible for that. These also look really good. Ooh. These look really good when my hair is up. I'm really big into putting my hair up, but I get migraines, so I don't do it as much as, I, as, much as I'd like to, but if you like to wear your hair up, I feel like this is a really good style for a high ponytail look. But most of the time, I just wear my hair down like this because it's easy, I have a lot going on, and I don't want to end up getting a migraine. These are incredible, and I highly recommend them. Need another look. This is the front. 
and they have this detail, this cutout detail right here. I think this is amazing. They're a little bit darker tinted, like a yellow tint. But the overall look of them is just so beautiful. Let me see if I can get it to focus there. It's better. So yeah. Also, when we were in California, I got one more pair of sunglasses. I'm going to show it to you. Okay, here's the other pair of sunglasses that I got. Let's put these right here. And these are from Palm Springs. They're a vintage uh, frame. And the store that I bought them from, they actually sent these out to a place in LA to replace the lenses and get them rose tinted. Isn't that so cool? So these are probably my new favorite, favorite sunglasses. They're very, very retro. These are Y2K and these are more like 80s. Um, and let me show you with a bag. Here are two different pink bags that go with these sunglasses. I know this is going to be a really long video, but the dopamine dressing, all pink, all one color, monochrome. I love it. And this is what the other one looks like. Crossbody works better. Some people can't wear the Coco handle crossbody, but it seems to work out pretty well for me. So I'm relatively flat chested on top, but I really like both of these looks. I wore this one the other day in a video and it was very fun, very practical. <laughs> this doesn't look very practical right now. I am obsessed with this color. I have been able to thankfully find a lot of things in this color lately. So if you love a color, buy everything in that color. Don't feel bad about it. Don't feel like you're gonna be judged. If you love the color, just wear the color. Okay, everyone, that was my video. Let me know what you thought of these sunglasses. So these sunglasses, let me know what you thought of the whole look with the bags and everything. Oh, I didn't show you guys what I would wear with these. Hold on. Okay, so I don't know if I'm crazy, but this is a vibe. I like this combination. Let me know what you think. I think it's cool. So as always, thank you so much for watching. Make sure that you like, comment, and subscribe to support me. Let me know which videos you'd like to see me make next, and I will catch you next time. Bye.